Yo, what up is Dom. Sam in the year. Soul Brothers. How you guys doing? Back up in it with a versus video. Ooh. Under Armour versus Under Armour. Yes. Steph Curry versus anybody rocking these in the NBA? Uh, Joel Embiid. He is. I, I seen that. <laughs> seen that. Joel Embiid. But this is the anatomic spawn three. Low. Three low. Three low. Okay. And that's the Curry six. Yeah. Pretty. That's my third pair of Curry six. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? They're pretty similar in price. Yeah. Uh, not too far apart. Both on the cheaper spectrum. Yes. The spawn being a little more so. Um, and they're both lows. Yes. And they're both under armor, so let's put them toe to toe. Yes, exactly. S starting with the traction. Traction, ooh, I don't know, man. These bite. Very well. But there is a gnarly defect that's going around. Yes. That Sammy got infected by. Oh, a man. few pairs. Mine are, still, mine are still holding up. Yes. But, you know, a lot of people have been riding this. But, you know, these aren't, they don't seem crazy durable mm, nope. either. And, you know, mine also did rip. Like, it's, it's, oh, man. Under armor, you guys need to do more. Uh, you guys need to do better on also yeah. durability, like really, like I don't know what you guys were thinking. I mean, I guess for performance, they're really good on a clean court. I tied up very, very good, very gnarly bites on a dusty court. I would say the Curry Six picks up a little bit more dust. I mean, the the anatomic spawn picks up dust as well, just a little bit, but it's like not really hugely affected by it. You know what I'm saying? So I think it's because like the rubber comes up a lot and it kind of like moves with the, like how you move. So maybe that kind of helps. I don't know, but uh, yeah, I see the anatomic spine is a little bit better on dust, just by a little bit. Curry six is still phenomenal. Like really doesn't pick up too much dust as well. And then um, durability, yeah, they're both. I feel like horrible. aside from the defect, the, the curry, yeah, the curry be a little better. Right? Yeah, exactly, exactly. Because like so much fraying on mine, dude. There's so much fraying. I mean that rubber is and stupid soft. And uh, this part right here, yeah. like what you found, that's ripping off. That just kind of like ripped, dude. Yeah. Um. So yeah, I would say the Curry Six is a little bit more durable, even though the Curry Six does fray off a lot too. So mm -hmm. yeah, I guess just because of that, I give the win to the Curry Six. But the anatomic spawn is still really nice. Moving on to the cushion, uh, mm -hmm. the Curries are pretty, uh, well, you know, Curry likes a pretty firm cushion. Yes. So they're nothing crazy. I mean, uh, how do they differ? Uh, the Micro G feels better. Mm -hmm. There you go. I mean, okay, so if basically everything the same. Core feel, I would say, is pretty much the same response, very, very similar. But the Micro G has a good amount of heel compression. There's no heel compression really at all in the Curry 6. Uh, the, so the Curry Six is actually using a, their new cushion hover, yes. which has been pretty lackluster in a lot of their basketball shoes that they've yes. been implementing it in. And uh, you know their old cushion Micro G seems to be beating it out here. Yeah, so there's a lot more heel compression in the anatomic spawn. Uh, also, it feels a lot softer, like throughout the entire uh, footbed. You know, the forefoot also feels soft, heel feels soft, impact protection is better, um, but also it doesn't sacrifice court feel and response. So yeah, and atomic spawn for the win for the cushion. All right, moving on to the upper. The Ooh. curries are crazy thin. And very crazy nice. And super nice. I, I love mean, it, dude. Yeah, they, they, they're, it's still a strong material, but it's like a, more of like a, a knit. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah, they, they're super nice. Yeah, uh, the anatomic spawn sacrifices quality. I mean, they, they, they use like a foam back mesh, which doesn't feel bad. I mean, it feels pretty nice on foot, but it feels like it's not the most premium feeling material at all yeah. and you have a lot of fuse overlay as well throughout the shoe so i really like the curry six especially like just putting it on you can just slide it on super easy uh the anatomic spawn you can't really do that and also it feels a lot better on foot because it just kind of stretches over your foot as well so yeah the curry six wins for materials all right fit fit uh go down half a size for both of the shoes i don't know why other armor has been uh, rather long so uh there's that but yeah i'd say the curry six is a little bit better for me because it just the knit just kind of just stretches over your foot and it, it just feels like more snug so curry six for the win there okay support and lockdown support and lockdown um for lateral containment i'd say the anatomic spawn is better uh especially if you're like a bigger dude like joel and Bede, Who's playing in the anatomic spawn right now? But I, like the Curry Six, I didn't really have any issues. Like, 
it, I wasn't sliding under the foot bed and it wasn't like unplayable, but I just felt the upper stretch in the forefoot here while I was doing a lot of movement. So just a little bit of stretch. So I'd say for lateral containment, the anatomic spine is a little bit better. Lateral support, I guess you're laterally stable in both of these shoes. I mean, they're both pretty damn wide. Uh, so I, I support in lockdown, I'd say the anatomic spine is just a little bit better, even though the Curry 6 wasn't horrible. All right, let's touch on weight. Weight. I, obviously the Curry 6 is going to be lighter, right? Yeah. 10.86 versus what, 11 point, oh no, 11.04, so. Pretty close, actually. 0.2 ounces. Both really light. Yes, both really light, very, very minimal. Um, I'd say they're around the same. Maybe the Curry 6 feels a little bit more minimal, but just because the fit feels a little bit like more snug and stuff like mm -hmm. that. But uh, responsive, they're both super responsive to play, and you're gonna feel light on your feet, so. Right, okay, um, just step in comfort, just overall comfort. Anatomic spawns, especially mm -hmm. with the soft micro G. Yes. Okay. Um, mm -hmm. And then break in time, both pretty ready to go out of the box. Yeah, you really don't need a break in the shoe at all. So, um, yeah. Okay. Uh, ventilation? Ventilation, uh, I give it a type. Very, very thin materials for both of the shoes. And uh, pretty airy. There's a good amount of airflow, so I'd say I give it a type. All right, durability? Oh, uh, dude, I don't know, man. Yeah, it's tough. They're both pretty bad. Tie it up, that's pretty bad for yes, both. Yes, yes. Um, aesthetics? Curry 6. Curry 6. Of course. For sure. Um, I guess let's wrap it up. Let's wrap it up. $110 versus $130. Bucks. $20 price difference. That's a good amount of money, I would say. But yeah, decent amount depending on who you are. Yeah, but uh, so if price does matter to you, yeah, Anatomic Spawn is a great, great shoe to play. I really like playing these. But I would say I like the Curry 6 a little bit more. Mm -hmm. I I don't know, man. Like I just love the fit and the materials. It's just so nice. Yeah, it's, it's so, so light and minimal. Yeah, but so, so are these. And the cushion is a little bit better. I mean, no, a good amount better. So it, it, I don't know, man. That's just a little bit of a trade-off for me. I li really like the materials in there and, and the fit and stuff like that, but I like the cushion. Like if this cushion was on the Curry 6, man, that would be so... How come yeah. Curry doesn't like Micro G? I don't know. Like, come on, Curry and Micro G is like the all day. Well, they moved on to Hover and we were hyped, but it uh, just wasn't you know, what we were expecting, so... Yeah, so like, yeah, so Anatomic Spawn, if, you, if money matters, but if money doesn't matter to you, I say the Curry 6, so... Alright, so that's it. If you guys want to cop either of these, we'll leave links below. Thank you guys for watching, and we'll see you guys next time. Later. Peace.